Hi, my name is Manuel Salazar. I'm climate activist, and today I want to talk to you about climate action, your employer, and you. Day after day, we get up and prepare ourselves for a productive day of work, a day where we hope to make the differences for a better planet. But have you ever thought how much of this work that you do every single day at home and at work impacts the environment? And most importantly, how much is your employer doing to tackle climate change? So today, I'm going to give you six steps that you can use to spot if your employer is doing enough to protect the environment and for you to take action and make the differences from inside. Bear with me. Number one, does your employer increase the knowledge on climate change? It is the duty of your employer to increase awareness and knowledge about climate change, and also to provide you with the tools and solutions at the corporate level to mitigate this impact. So your task is to get involved, research, and ask your employer to bring climate change at the center of the business model and the strategy for now and the future and also to provide you with trainings that will help you to understand how climate change has impacted you as an individual, as a part of a community, as an employee, of course, and as a citizen of this country. Number two, climate assessments. Ask your employer to introduce a climate assessment for every single project they take on. If there is assessments for equality and diversity, why not to have a climate impact assessment and all the services that your employer offers? Number three, the fossil fuel pledge. Companies and corporations have to realize that if they don't tackle climate change seriously and protect the environment, they won't have an economy to save and the survival of the business won't exist. So that is why it's important that your employer set a moral stand and have a public pledge where they won't invest in fossil fuels or any industry and sectors that can harm the environment. Number four, assess your employer clients. There is no secret that there are companies out there actively investing in fossil fuels. So the action here is to ask your employer to review all the footprints of their clients and also to step away from those contracts that are harming the environment. Number five, internal benefits. Ask your employer to review and assess every single benefit they acquire for you, such insurance, healthcare, and pensions. Have you asked yourself if your monthly pensions contribution go into fossil fuels? And if that's the case, ask your employer why you haven't reviewed this. Number six, wake up and walk out for the climate. If you feel that your employer is not doing enough to protect the environment, you can organize a walkout for the climate and increase pressure on them to drastically address climate change. And finally, I want to leave you with a reflection. There is no better time to be an activist than right now. If you turn on your TV or you browse through your social media, you will see that our planet is burning, is drowning, and you also see that our environmental, social, and human rights are all under threat. And if you're a clerk, or if you're an accountant, or if you're an IT person, a teacher, or a nurse, no matter what profession you have, you can also be an activist. Activism does not diminish your profession or you as a person, but complements it. And if you ask yourself, who can really tackle climate change? If it's not us, then who? And if it's not now, when?